Hi, my name is Martes and I am lead consultant for IT Assurance and ISO Outsourcing at RSM Malta. I am very proud to have built a career in such a fast-paced and constantly evolving field as information technology. My career in IT spans a period of close to 30 years. I graduated as an electrical engineer from the University of Malta in 1992. Six years later, I read for a master's degree in information management from the University of Lancaster in the UK. Um, my first job straight after graduating in, in electrical engineering was in IT and I held various IT management positions in the hospitality and travel sector over the next 25 years. These past five years, I have moved into consulting where I am using my broad experience and wide knowledge of solutions in information technology and information security to help organizations improve their digital capabilities. My work is remarkably interesting and I find it extremely rewarding. I have the opportunity to provide practical solutions to problems and to drive change in the, and the digital transformation. My interest in technology started at a very early age. I don't remember me wanting any other career except engineering. Um, I was always interested in maths and physics as subjects at school and I decided I wanted to pursue a career in engineering in level 8, form 2 back then. When I entered the University of Malta in 1988, the choice of computing and IT degrees was extremely limited. So if you wanted to study IT, the obvious choice was electrical engineering and we had the option to specialize during the last two years of the degree. I never considered my being a woman as a disadvantage to pursue the career that I wanted. Nowadays, we are lucky to have such a wide choice of IT-related courses and job opportunities to pursue. Job opportunities that allow us, as women, to have the flexibility to work at an office or from home, um, to find the right work-life balance that fits our unique needs as women. The tech industry is a great environment to work in for many reasons. Some people are still astonished when I state that I am an engineer, that I pursue the career in IT and with reason. We are still seeing signs of a persistent gender bias in career choices. Whilst I am fully aware that more females are engaging in STEM subjects, the numbers are still significantly below the male numbers. My message to girls who are enthusiastic about IT and looking at pursuing a career in this subject is to dare to be different. The rewards of a career in IT are countless and it is up to us to break the bias.